you always hear that baseball is a game of inches, whether it's the pitcher's mound and it's 60 feet 6 inches or a ball that was fair or foul by just this much or maybe a pitch misses the outside corner by just an inch. But what about this measurement? I guess that really does make it a game of inches. We're going to explore this and a whole lot more today on Clubhouse Gas. My pleasure now to be joined by Jim Lloyd. Jim, thanks for joining us. It's a pleasure to be here. How about you start off by telling us how long you've been involved with youth athletics? I started uh, coaching uh, with my son uh, as a sort of as a dad a helper in 1980 and became a, an official coach in 1982, Casey. Became so, a manager in 1993. So you've been a manager for 14 years. That's pretty good math. And you've been uh, involved in coaching for, what, 27 years now? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, a lot of what we're talking about today, though, doesn't have to do with coaching baseball. It has to do with maintaining the facilities here at the baseball field. How long have you been doing that? I've been doing that about nine years. What do you enjoy more? Do you enjoy getting out there and keeping the fields up or, or coaching and working with the boys? Uh, I like coaching and working with the boys more. But there's a, uh, there's a certain uh, affinity for doing those fields, too, that uh, once you start doing that and getting those ready for those boys to come play on, it gets in your blood. When you see them out there playing and having a good time on something that you've worked so hard on, it's got to be a a real blessing to your heart. You know, more, more than that that you mentioned it, more than that, it's uh, I remember the first time I ever stepped on a, a prepared baseball field, the magic of that, <laughs> and I try to give that to the kids, you know, because well, everybody has that first time right. when you step out there and it's green and it's the lines are perfect and uh, the mound is there and it's brown and the grass, and the grass is green and the sand is smooth or the dirt, whatever you're playing on right. is smooth. There's nothing quite like that. What, you obviously, as a coach, travel to different ballparks and you see how other people prepare their fields. Is there something? There's got to be something that's a pet peeve of yours when you see it and you go, "Oh, maybe that wouldn't happen in my park." Well, absolutely, because when you're a perfectionist, it's a curse. Right. And I'll go to another park and I'll see if those lines don't meet where they're supposed to meet in those batter's boxes. I know right away that guy <laughs> didn't know what he was doing, and I feel a little sense of pride. <laughs> Now, the, the rumor around here, I've had a chance to talk to a few of your colleagues, and the rumor around here, Coach, is when your team is playing, it never rains, and all your bunts stay fair. Is, is that true? Do you have anything to say to those coaches who told me that earlier? Yeah, see, I tell you what. You go back and tell those comedians. <laughs> let them get themselves out there and try to get a feel ready to play. Now you heard that, guys. Coach Lloyd says you get out there and give it a shot. What, what do you say you get out here and you show me some tips and, and maybe uh, I'll help you out with the field a little bit? You know, it's hot today and I do need some help. Would you mind helping me today? I could use to sweat off a couple of pounds. Good deal. All Good right, deal. Thanks, Let's coach. do it. Let's go. All right, Coach. So we've talked about this at great length, and I think that I'm ready to, to, to help you out. You look, you got a lot to get done today. Is, is there something I, I need a do? little help today, Casey. Would you mind lining off with side for me today? Hey, not a problem. All, All right, right fantastic. That. All right, you take that. All right, good. Now, that's your traditional lining machine right there. It's used all over the country. It's a combination machine that you can use either baseball or football. But for the most part, yep, those down there. For the most part, I just use that one right there. If you'll open that trap door, the line will play out and you can line her off. Casey, try to stay on a straight line now. Left, Casey, left. More left, Casey. That's better, good. Good job, Casey, good job. Notice how I'm a positive influence. Coach, I'm real sorry. I know you trusted me to do that line, and it was kind of crooked. I, I apologize. You know what? I played a little joke on you, Casey. Yeah. <laughs> well, he's, I've got a tool here that makes this job a whole lot easier. <laughs> so we're going to let you try it one more time using the tool. All right, a redo. Okay. I got a redo. This is a cord reel. 
Got a little stake on the end. We put it down right here at the home plate. And I'm going to run it out there to first base, and then you can run a straight line down there, okay? Theoretically. All right, Coach. Well, today we've learned from Jim Lloyd that keeping the field looking good is not all that easy, but it's extremely important. So these boys can come out here and play in the dirt. I'm going to get out here and work it for them and smooth it out. I'll see you guys tomorrow on Clubhouse Gas. I'm Casey Bass. See you, everybody.